Live outside now, it looks like fog, but it's not. It's the haze hovering over the Bay Area, a shot from our Sutro Tower camera. KPX 5's Jackie Ward continues our team coverage live in Nevada with the air quality concerns and how one school is making special arrangements. Jackie? Yeah, Michelle, as you can tell behind me, the kids are out of school for the day, and that's a little bit early than their usual schedule here at Loma Verde Elementary. I'm sure the kids are very relieved because this is one of the schools in Novato that does not have air conditioning. The Novato Unified School District made the call last night. Today, kindergarten through fifth grade were released at noon, while grades 6 through 12 will be let out at 1245. Parents like Lawrence Monteroso appreciate this decision. I think it's good for the kids because... Uh, it's already hot right now. It feels hot already, and I think it's, you know, we want to be sure that all the kids are, 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 you know, safe. The principal here at Loma Verde Elementary says this school was built in the 1950s, long before air conditioners were put into schools. But that's changing soon, thanks to voters who approved Measure G last November, a $222 million measure for school improvements. With the heat comes a cloudy haze that continues to make its presence known in the north and east bays, and there are a couple of reasons for that. One is high heat in the inland portions of the Bay Area, and the other is uh, particulates and soot that are coming from fires in southern Oregon and northern California. Janitors were here as early as 5 this morning in order to open up all the windows, try and attempt to get some cool, fresh morning air inside the building while it still lasted. It didn't last very long, though. The teachers allowed the kids to have water bottles at their desk all day, though. They're taking every precaution possible to make sure the kids stay cool. In Novato, Jackie Ward, KPIX 5.